sweet. Born like this, into this, as the chalk faces smile, as Mrs. Death laughs, as the elevators break, as political landscapes dissolve, as a supermarket bag boy holds a college degree, as the oily fish spit out their oily prey, as the sun is masked. We are born like this, into this, into these carefully mad wars, into the sight of broken factory windows of emptiness, into bars where people no longer speak to each other, into fistfights that end up as shootings and knifings. Born into this, into hospitals which are so expensive that it's cheaper to die, into lawyers who charge so much it's cheaper to plead guilty, into a country where the jails are full and the madhouses closed, into a place where the masses elevate fools into rich heroes. Born into this, walking and living through this, dying because of this, muted because of this, castrated, debauched, disinherited because of this, fooled by this, used by this, pissed on by this, made crazy and sick by this, made violent, made inhuman by this. The heart is blackened, the fingers reach for the throat, the gun, the knife, the bomb. The fingers reach toward an unresponsive God. The fingers reach for the bottle, the pill, the powder. We are born into the sorrowful deadliness. We are born into a government 60 years in debt that will soon be unable to even pay the interest on that debt. And the banks will burn. Money will be useless. There will be open and unpunished murder in the streets. It will be guns and roving mobs. Land will be useless. Food will become a diminishing return. Nuclear power will be taken over by the many. Explosions will continually shake the earth. Radiated robot men will stalk each other. The rich and the chosen will watch from space platforms. Dante's Inferno will be made to look like a children's playground. The sun will not be seen and will always be night. Trees will die. All vegetation will die. Radiated men will eat the flesh of radiated men. The sea will be poisoned. The lakes and rivers will vanish. Rain will be the new gold. The rotting bodies of men and animals will stink in the dark wind. The last few survivors will be overtaken by new and hideous diseases. And the space platforms will be destroyed by attrition and the petering out of supplies, the natural effect of general decay. And there will be the most beautiful silence never heard, born out of that. The sun hidden there, awaiting the next chapter.